Hello and welcome to the Lunar Gate. This is a fun place. Also, uh, huh. We can just walk right through that. I felt so sure that someone would get a walk out of it, though. Hmm. Well, whatever. Hmm. Excuse me. We have been expecting you. This way, please. It's Angelo! Which reminds me, I should probably... It's gonna be okay. I'll take care of Renoa. Lead the way, please. Are you the ones taking off? Okay, this way. Is it though? I mean, obviously Squall is taking off, but uh... Hmm. Okay, so I'm just doing this now to make sure I don't forget later on. Okay. Because as far as I'm aware, that doesn't actually matter so long as Reno is not in the party. Distance-wise, it's pretty far, but you'll be there in no time. You'll be there by the time you wake up. Where are we going? Ah. <laughs> Let me give you a quick explanation about the whole process. First, we need you to enter the capsule inside the pipe. Here, you'll undergo the cold sleep process. Once this process is complete, your capsule will automatically be loaded into the booster. After that, we launch! You should be there by the time you wake up. Leave the rest to the staff once you get there. Well, that's about it in a nutshell. I won't say that there isn't any risk involved. What do you want to do? I'll do whatever it takes. WHATEVER IT TAKES! Okay, you'll need to decide who you're taking. The girl in blue has already undergone cold sleep and has been loaded in. There's room for one more. So, we're not allowed to take Adia or one other person. In the meantime, something must be done to suppress my powers. But it'd be too dangerous for Matron to be alone. Then let me be your escort. Come on, Squall, what do you say? Yeah, we cannot take Zell either. Yeah, we may as well trust him. He's the... As incompetent as his mouth is, his body is surprisingly competent. <laughs> I'll do whatever it takes to watch over you. Don't worry about a thing. So, normally I would take Irvine, but I kind of want to leave him behind. I, it's because of his level. It's because he has a high level, that's why I want to leave him behind. Uh, so, since that's the case, I'm going to take Quistus with me instead. And I got extra levels in Selfie, but I'm probably not going to use it, because I've double-checked, and... Adia's level doesn't actually transfer over to Renoa. Uh... As far as I know, I thought it did at first, that's why I didn't use her. Um, because, like, obviously, obvi obviously, we we're gonna need to fight on the ground, but, uh, yeah. The easiest way for me to get a level 30 party, average level, is to have both of these guys. So that's what I'm gonna do. Junction exchange, you can give that to you, and you can give that to you. 
and you'll notice that I took them away from Squall. Uh, we are not going to be doing any fighting with Squall for a while. Oh, we're going to be doing really interesting things with Squall, but not fighting. about us. Live to me, Squall. All capsules are in place. Conditions inside the capsules are normal. Boosters on standby, all systems normal. Launch error correction, plus two, orbital correction, minus one. Corrections complete! Go! 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 It has even a revolver mechanism. <laughs> I love that so much. Man, I hope everything goes well. They'll be fine. I think they're in good hands. Let's pray for their safe return. Shall we go? Missed the occult fan. Uh, there's an occult fan number four is in Esthar, and I didn't, I didn't pick it up before now. Uh, uh oh. Uh, this is probably fine. I mean, I mean, that, that's the Esthar's artifact in the first place, right? Well, I guess we better head for the city and definitely not spend the next a two hours grinding against monsters. Uh... Probably not that long. Uh... The... Genuinely, the main contributing factor is not even whether or not we... The levels doesn't matter. We're gonna hit the level we need easily enough. And... The, uh... We actually have to use the DNA now. And we'll probably hit the AP we need as well. The trick will be getting enough of those monsters that we need. Just straight up. That That's going to be the hard part. <laughs> uh, so, having said that, uh, let's see if we can do something about that. Now, if I'm correct, uh, I want to save here. I believe that the best place for encountering them is uh, in the far north part of this area, open area. Nope, you're not what I want. I will still fight you because, uh, oh, okay, or I'll just get Zen Tetsuken. I mean, I do actually need a bunch of levels on Cell in particular. A D and Irvine, maybe five each, is all they need. But Cell, Zell is gonna need to pick up the. Zell's gonna need to be higher than more than that because he's a lot lower.
So yeah, if I am correct, and you know, I genuinely may not be, but if I am correct, then uh, I'm most likely to encounter them up here. I might want to look that up though. Um, one second. Right, okay, so, oh, wait, is this a single target thing? Whatever, I wanted to show this off. Uh, yeah, so, it is single target, it's still pretty cool though. Um, you know what, you should, uh, heal. You should steal, you should card. I guess. Do I actually want a card, though? I may as well not until I've gotten to the, uh, good level for what I want. Which is also why I just leveled it up, because he'll g it'll give me more experience that way, I think. Idea is not great at hitting people, unfortunately. But, uh, the bad news is the enemy that I want is actually a pretty rare encounter here. Uh, also. Oh, hey. The fun then just got something. Okay, we can, uh, restart on Recover, I guess. Right, so as I was saying, the encounter I want is actually a pretty rare encounter, but, uh, I only need, like, two or three of them. And then that'll get me it. You know what, though, it would probably help if I took off Encounter None. Uh, just a hunch there. Encounter half, rather. Whatever. Same difference, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, I really am gonna put on ribbon now, though, because, uh, it's only a matter of time. Like, seriously, I'm sure you can figure- I'm, I've still not said it out loud, but I'm sure you can figure out what I'm after. And this is not it! Okay, I think what I'll do is I'll cut until I find one. So that I can show you, because I, I want to show you what I'm after, you know? Oh, okay. So, uh, yeah, I'll be back in hopefully only a minute or two. Uh, we'll see, I guess. Uh, oh, no. Nope, this is not it. We've, we've, we've found something new, so I'm going to show it here. But this is not what we were looking for. <laughs> what even is this? Hex Dragon. Okay. Maybe a better, uh... Ah, that doesn't really do me any good. Okay, well... My gut feeling is that you're probably not vulnerable to fire, so... The level is really low, though. Only 17. We definitely need to bring that average up. 17 is not high enough. Ooh, 
Ooh. That hurt a bit. I mean, I'll just use Phoenix down if he kills Irvine, frankly. I don't actually care that much. I don't know how much HP this has, though. I don't know how much AP it gives, either. Like, I was genuinely not- oh, I should have used the one right there. I was genuinely not expecting to encounter this. So... I'm definitely in the right area, though. Well, yeah, that was good for the leveling. Definitely. Well, can't complain about 8 AP. Let's see, E3, who might be out of other things to get. Yeah, summon magic or bust. And also you, learn to defend. Oh yeah, I should, uh, I should probably heal. She has so much HP! It's terrific. Okay. This is the Norta's Mountains, specifically. Whereas before I was on the Great Plains of Esthar, where I'm pretty sure I can find the enemy I want over there. But, uh, I know for absolute certain that it shows up here. Uh, so I'll go back to cutting until I find something more interesting, I think. So I'll uh, see you in a moment, hopefully. Oh, we found one! Yeah, it's a Malboro. It is fucking scary, and it will murder me. Really quickly. Uh, yeah. Because it'll do that. Fortunately, I have someone who is completely immune. It also has, like, a lot of HP. It's worth saying. Yeah, you so you see this bullshit? They are berserk. They have berserk, poison, sleep. Uh, Silence, Doom, Confusion, uh, Darkness, and that's just what I know off the top of my head. Fortunately, I have someone who's completely immune. I did not get off a mug, though. That's unfortunate. Uh, yeah, you can just, uh... Fortunately, Doom doesn't tick down while they're sleeping. <laughs> but yeah, Malboros are, like, really scary in this game. Like, if I were not doing this with, uh... Oh, they have slow as well. Hmm. Were I not doing this on the PC where I can just get ribbon from Chocobo World, I would, uh... Well, first of all, hopefully I would have more stage immunity on more than one person. Like, you would hope that, right? But, uh, beyond that... I d I'm not even sure how the hell that happened. But, beyond that, I would try to mug it once, and then I would either run away or spam GFs. Probably run away. Maybe hope Odin just showed up. But, like, actually, no. That's not true. The best way to actually handle these is uh, with Quistus. Uh, her de degenerator limit break can. I don't think it can one shot a Malboro, but it can two shot one. Uh, 
If I were doing this without Ribbon, that is how I would do it. Frankly, it's probably how I should be doing it now, but I sent... I sent Quistus to space, so, you know, there you go. You know, it occurs to me, I could just throw, like, a Remedy at Irvine. Or, well, Adia died. Uh... I mean, I do have 60 of them. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll do that. I have 80, in fact. Because I think it only ever uses bad breath at the start of the battle. I'm not 100% on that, but I think that's the case. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna use Ice Strike. If I got a mug off, it would be nice, but it's not necessary. So, oh hey, awesome. So, I don't know if I mentioned this before as well, but, uh, Malboros have, like, crazy high HP. Oh, there we are. But they do give a lot of experience. And I think AP, but definitely experience. I'm not sure why it has just stopped doing things. Oh yeah, that's- that's a lot. Uh... Okay, so, we need to fight at least two more of those. Uh, preferably... more, because... Let's see... Nope, not that. Not that one. I need two Malboro tentacles for this. Or did I already have some Malboro tentacles actually? I may have. Uh I did not. Uh, well I had one, I guess, because I talked Quistus bad breath. Uh okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna stop off here. Uh Next time, I will have finished battling Malboros. I'll have all of the tentacles I want, and... I'm not exactly sure where my levels would be, but I need it so that my average level is about 30. So, uh, how high these guys are depends on how high Zell gets, pretty much. So, uh, yeah. Until then, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII with Chaos Blue, and have a great day. Bye!